Well, hey gang, what's happening? Kelly here with Feast and Physique. How y'all doing today? Coming at you with your move of the day. I think this week we're going to focus on some nice little quick four station HIIT training programs. So, or routines. <clears throat> HIIT training stands for High Interval Intensity Training, or High Intensity Interval Training, excuse me. Um, and again, similar to Tabata, what that means is we want to try to push ourselves to work as hard as we can in those work burst intervals, right? So when I hit train, I usually work for 45 seconds on, 15 seconds off as I rotate to my next station. Some people like to do 30 seconds of work with no rest in between each station until they get through with their first round of all stations and then they take a little break. So you can play around with it, see what works best for you. This week I'm gonna come at you with four station hit routines uh, that I challenge you to see how many rounds you can do. I personally am gonna try to do six rounds of each routine this week. So, best of luck, let's get down to it, shall we? So the first one we're gonna do, <clears throat> our four moves are gonna be uh, one forward, two back, so it's a big squat jump forward one time, and then we use our arms to pump ourselves back twice. So one forward, two back, right? Nice soft landings on the knees. Okay, so that's our first move, and you'll do that for like 30 seconds or 45 seconds or whatever you set your work timer up for, okay? Then your next move, got my little notes over here. Next move, we're gonna be doing a lateral lunge with a jump in the center, lateral lunge, hop in the center, right? On these lateral lunges, we really wanna make sure we're sticking that booty out, I'll turn sideways, hinging at the waist, right? Again, nice soft landing on those knees. Torso is staying tall. Hard knees and toes are staying pointed forward. That's your second move. Already breathing hard, right? And I'm barely even exerting myself, okay? So your third move, we're gonna take it down to the ground. We're gonna do crossover push-ups. Okay, so hopefully you can see me on this one, gang. Without camera person. Turn it sideways, here we go. All right, so for crossover push-ups, we're gonna cross our hands over ourselves, push up, press back into those feet, cross back over, push up. Okay, so it's one way and the other, right? And you can do these on your knees, of course, wherever you're at your push up game. So, crossover push ups is going to be your third move. Ooh, and then our fourth move, while we're down on the ground, we're going to do mountain climbers. So, we're going to stay in this great plank position, okay? We're gonna drive our knees to our chest as quickly as we can, right? So there you got it. You're gonna work so many seconds on, so many seconds off. I recommend 45 on, 15 off. And you're gonna do those four moves. So again, it's one forward, two back. Nice big squat jumps. Soft landing on the knees. Okay, cranking those out as quick as you can. Right into lateral lunge hops, right? Both directions lateral lunging, or you can burn out one leg one round. Third station is gonna be those crossover push-ups, right? More than welcome to do them on your knees. And then our fourth station in our little hit routine we're doing this week is gonna be mountain climbers. Whew, give it a shot, gang. Let me know how many rounds you get cranked out and keep tuning in. If you like what you're seeing, be sure to share it with your friends and family. Check me out on YouTube or feastandphysiquenoco.com. Have a great day, guys. Bye.